This question reviews some algebra and shape and space problem solving. We're given a right angle triangle and we've got the two dimensions, 4x and the 2x plus the 3. And we're asked to find x if the area is 20. Now, step one is we can find an expression for the actual area, which is a half times by the base times by the height. Now the base times the height is 4x lots of 2x plus 3 and it's a half of that expression. Now this can be simplified in different ways but a half of 4x is just 2x. So this is the same as 2x lots of 2x plus 3. I've just halved the 4x. I can then expand it. Well, 2x times 2x is 4x squared, and 2x times 3 is 6x. So this is an expression for the area of the triangle. Now we know the area, so I can now set up an equation. 4x squared plus 6x has got to equal 20. We're told the area equals 20. So to find x, I need to solve this equation. It's an x squared equation, it's quadratic. So to solve this, I need to get the equation equal to 0. So I can take away 20 from both sides. 4x squared plus 6x take away 20 equals 0. And I can also make this simpler if I divide by 2 to get the numbers lower. If I divide by 2, I get 2x squared plus 3x take away 10. So 2x squared plus 3x take away 10 equals 0. So this is now an x squared equation to solve. Now to solve this, I can use the formula. I've got a equal to 2, b equal to 3, c equal to minus 10. And the formula is x equals minus b plus or minus the square root of b squared minus 4ac all over 2 lots of a. So, so I need to sub my numbers 2, 3 and minus 10 into that formula there. So in this case my values of x could be x equals b is 3, so minus 3, plus or minus. Now my advice is to write out the entire thing carefully with the numbers in. So 3 squared minus 4 times a times c, all over 2 lots of a. Now I can enter this as it is into a calculator to work it out, but I will just do a few more steps before I do that. Minus 3 plus or minus 3 squared is 9. 4 times 2 times 10 is 8 times 10, which is 80. Two negatives make it plus 80. And that's all over 4, because 2 times 2 is 4. So to finish off, and this was non-calculator, 9 plus 80 is 89, all over 4. However, I can now work out the possible answers for x by working out this on a calculator. I can enter it with a plus or with a minus. So x equals either now minus 3 plus root of 89 over 4 works out to be, and we're almost there, 1.61 to 2 dp. Or if I do the minus 1, so minus 3 take root 89, we end up with x equals minus 3.11.
Now because x represents lengths within a triangle, x cannot be negative because that would give me a negative height, so therefore the solution for this triangle is that x equals 1.61 to 2 dp.